Hello everybody, we're back once again. Welcome. I am Prompt Dude and today we continue the quarry quarry quarry. I still don't know how to pronounce it properly, but we're back. Continuing where we left off last time. When one of the character skin blew up all over everybody else. To like So let's um Jeez, it's been a minute. Let's see, let's see. I know they're in the bath. Oh! I know what happened. Um, Laura. Laura. Laura came back. That's what happened last time. That's what we're doing today. We're hearing what happened to Laura. So, let's see. What's you going come. On. Where have you been for the past two months? We did come. One night early. That was our mistake. Oh gosh, are we getting a flashback? Are we getting a flashback? My friend, get in there. Fucking do it. It's been so long. What have you done to Max? Shut up. You can't just shut up. This is an interrogation. I ask, you answer. Name. May I should be compliant? Let's see. Laura Kearney. Who are you traveling with? And what is your relationship? Friend. Where were you headed last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Matt? No. I ask, you answer. That's how this works. I don't know if I should keep being compliant with this guy. I don't know how to feel about it. Hopefully my audio has been working this whole time. Because then I would be... No bueno. No bueno. Let's just be compliant. Fine. 
What do you want to know? Oh. Well. Uh, why were we going to Hackett's Quarry last night? Max and I are camp counselors. Oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we drove up and got there early. We figured we'd just go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were, like, way closer to the That's camp, the and oh, we're broke. Mm -hmm. Okay, Sheriff. Hackett. Hackett? Wait, Hackett? Like, Chris Hackett? Don't change the subject. This guy's related to the counselor? What the fuck is going on here, man? You have no idea what's going on here. Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime, go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option is to buckle the fuck up and do what I say. Do you understand? trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on. Is, is, Max, is alive? Max alive? The real questions. I feel like I'm going crazy. I'm very, very quiet. That's not hey. good. Uh, hey, you asshole! Where's his clothes? You want to tell us what the fuck's going on? Max! I know you hear me! Jesus. to be nice to them considering Max. we left them behind last time. Are you okay? Are you serious? You just left me to fucking die, Lord. Do you really care if I'm okay? Defensive? No. Apologetic. I don't know what to say, Max. I I was terrified out of my mind. I I don't know what I was thinking. I guess I can't expect you to think clearly in a situation like I honestly thought he was dead. Well, whatever that was. I'm shocked he's alive. I'm sorry. I'll get over it. Laura? Yeah. Why am I naked? What? That's a good question. I mean, after we got attacked, the next thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell, and you're Is gone, he? and Is now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood and stuff everywhere. Oh, that's not good. I mean, what the fuck happened? That's not good at all. I was kind of hoping you could tell me what happened. I feel like I remember bits and pieces, but none of it makes any sense. Yeah, same. I, I feel like... Were we drugged? I feel like maybe we were drugged. By a cop? Do they do that? Who does this guy think he is? Well, Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max! What? Did you even look at the map? 
Hackett's Quarry in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. Oh. Max didn't look at the map. And it gets better. I gotta look at his name badge and... Get dressed. What's he giving you? I'm not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? I hate kissing this guy's ass, but I don't want to piss him off more than we already have. Sorry, sir. We'll be quiet. You will? Max? Hey, what'd you do with my real girlfriend? I hate it. I don't want to... I don't want to do this. Oh, the cop didn't expect this. Oh, oh. Alright, buddy. Hands through the bars. Come on. Your turn. Oh, he's gonna Let's go. Him. I'm not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Come on. Hey, hey. Let's get the fuck off. Come on. Right. Move. Good boy. Hey, stop struggling. Max, calm down. You're only making up worse. Laura. What the hell did you do to her? Shut up. Man, he's so confused as to why we're being okay. so just into it. <laughs> okay. Really think, Laura, think. There's gotta be something in here you can use. What's this? Some sort of lever. I don't know. I feel like some people would. Can I? Oh. Get in here. Okay. While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. What happens to her eyes? Watch it, man. I bruise easily. Give me a break. Hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Sure. Second you get out. Wait! 
Wait, well, answer your questions. You just can't lock us up in here with no goddamn explanation and expect us to be all butter and cupcakes, okay? Just work with us here. You have nothing to bargain with. Come on. Come on! <laughs> in here hey come back what do you do as being compliance and work in secret to get away or gain power if you're fast and quick enough Fuck. I guess Son of a binky I wouldn't want to antagonize them or like come off too aggressive that's for sure playful you want me to be playful are you okay? It's just a foot. It'll heal. I meant the interrogation. Oh. Yeah. Can't break old Max. Many have tried, many have failed. I'm being serious, Max. I guess he's being playful. He just... He asked a lot of dumb questions. Alright, I don't know. Would you get off my back? Jeez, I'm sorry. gonna happen oh hey did you get a look at his name badge you mean it's not really detective dick with it <laughs> it's Hackett sheriff Hackett you think he's related to Chris Hackett oh my god like the Chris Hackett yeah who's the Chris Hackett oh my god bro it's as in camp stupid? leader mr. Hackett of Hackett's quarry remember I feel like Max just doesn't know what the hell's going on. Ian before Last night this. feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean though? You know? Were we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's that makes sense. I mean What? <laughs> Some kind of setup. Like some kind of setup, a, a, a trap. I don't know. Chris Hackett and Sheriff Hackett. There's no way that's a coincidence. Okay. They must be related. Well, what does that prove? They knew we were coming. Maybe it's some kind of kidnapping, extortion, conspiracy. Or you just showed that's up early. That's a pretty big job. And they expected you to. I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. I don't know. What if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, you we have to. Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? This isn't forever, this isn't forever Max. You, you can't just hold us here forever. You didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that. Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And How school? are these guys dating? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're... gonna, um... What? I'm gonna what? I saw the letter, Max. What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. You were poking around in my her. stuff? No. I can't believe you didn't tell me. I was embarrassed. Wait, your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Fuck! Have you been making plans, Max? What the fuck? I don't know. What do you want me to say? 
right? Their chemistry is like so off. Like she seems like such a different personality than his. I'm sorry, Max. This, this really sucks. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. I'm sorry. Oh, he apologized. I shouldn't have kept it from you. You, you know have. you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Max appreciates your sympathy. Oh. Thankfully, this makes up for leaving him to die. Okay, let's just focus on getting out of here for now. Just Great, sign me up. We need to go over it from the beginning. Like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the... Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. Do you think it was a good idea to have lied to him? About hitting a pothole? Yeah. I don't know. I think he probably knew we were lying. He was acting really strange. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's gotta be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. He appreciates we're in a police things. station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... nobody else around. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole hack it hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead, there's nobody there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I, I remember the steps and a smell like wet fur and a, a dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. I don't think it was a dog that attacked us. Whatever it was, was big. Like, person-sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like, I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like, like, like I safe. vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. What is messed up about that is... Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. What the hell happened? What? Hey, okay, so weird question. Do you remember... before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods. And you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max, it happens once a month. Yeah, so? Right, so, you know, full moon. Yeah. You don't think Max is Max? What if? I mean, he's acting like Max. Uh, okay, no. Stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. <gasps> he said it. He said the thing. Are you out of your- Goddamn mine? Werewolves? Werewolves? Seriously? What the fuck? Hey, we're back. What? 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 What's so funny? I said literally the exact same thing. Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like- Zombies, aliens, time hopping Draculas. <laughs> Ryan, shut the fuck up. <laughs> I want to be aggressive. Let's be aggressive. Ryan, right? Yeah. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> you let her finish, man. Would it really be so crazy with all the? shit that we've been seeing with Nick? With the thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those, are, those are just campfire stories. Like, there has to be a rational explanation for everything, for all nope. of this. That's why he exploded out his Okay, you were not like talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And if it's bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. What? You did the right thing. See? She's got a whole poem about it. There's more to all this than you think. What is he showing him? Just 
let me finish. Oh, her eye. You can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. I thought they just have time to like go over the entire story. And just like be like, yeah, so this is what happened. There's a bunch of werewolves outside. The next but... few weeks were long. Weeks? The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot. As much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop. The camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. Hi, Seafell. Welcome to the stream. For the first time. I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. They're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. Hey, we need a, a plan. We keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so, you know, let me know if you have one. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Just keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth? Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. All right, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or... We try to catch him off guard and make our escape. Um... What if we get on his good side? Okay, so... Let's say we get on his good side. What then? Brunch in mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways? Yeah, I was being rhetorical. The dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know. I think we could crack him. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. Permanently. I think we should try. I mean, if he was gonna kill us, we'd be dead by now. So what's he waiting for? Look, we just... If this doesn't work, we try to escape. Deal? Yeah. Deal. So, all right, how are we supposed to get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. Slow night, slow night. I mean, he's got to have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. Very slow night. Hey, hey! T-Money! Can I call you T-Money? Why? Not tea money, bro. You can call me Officer Hackett. Hackett? R.I.P. Tea money. Like as in Hackett's quarry? What's it to you? Just interested is all. Feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way, okay? Oh, come on, tea money. Lighten up, man. No reason we can't be buds, right? I can think of seven. Seven reasons? Jesus. You're right. We've been just awful, and we really want to make it up to Angel! You. Oh. I see what you're doing. Well, it's not gonna work. 
You think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk right out of here. Not gonna happen. Asshole! Oh. Well, he Max. saw right through us. He literally saw right through us. Angel, you I know what's not, going on? I have not killed a single we person. We know Max is a werewolf! Oh! Full oh. moon's in a few days, right? What, what then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Tell us then. Jesus, tell us. What is the other half? I said, take your fucking clothes off. Fuck off! Get back! Max, what's, what's going happening? on? Get the fuck away from him! Jesus, they've been there a month. What's he trying to get his clothes off? Shut up. Have a seat. Yeah, it's the girl from the beginning, it's Laura. <laughs> We're back Quit to the beginning of the game. See what happens. Dad, you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Let me go! You're not going to believe it until you see it for yourself. Just fucking ask next time then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. Oh, his name is actually T. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Help! Hey, he's got his whole prisoner at the police station! Help us! Who was that? Over. Nothing. On my way. Over. That was pretty stupid. Oh man. We're just getting on his good side. Hey, you can't just leave me here! Yes, I can. D damn. Yo, Max ain't looking too hot, bro. Max, tell me exactly what you're feeling. Laura, I... I don't feel so good. Oh, no. Not good like how? I don't know, just... bad. Come closer, let me see your eyes. I think I better stay back. Max, I need to observe you. Is this fucking close enough for you, bitch? Whoa. Let's use our inside voices next time, Max. Oh, it turns to ash. Max? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Max? Oh god. Tell me what's going on! <laughs> There you go. Oh. oh my god, her eye! Oh, that's how it happened. Let's 
see what that bastard cop's hiding. Oh god. Is he still in there? Holy hell. Guy no more. Oh, I got a little card. He's not looking too hot, you know. Having a little, a little bit of an episode, you know. Where are you hiding, Travis? What? Wait, I can't read that. It's gone to my attention and recently released an episode of your podcast that features the town of Northkill and more specifically Hackett's Quarry. If I am to understand the context of why at least an inv episode investigates the mystery of a ghost in the woods. But the very idea has been completely preposterous, and I'm sure if you're aware no such thing exists, I am ready to tell you that the proprietors of Hecate's War you have expressed concerns that such unsavory stories could be detrimental to the various business avenues, including Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp, which prides itself on being a safe, fun environment for children from all over the country. It is with this in mind that I ask that you take down this episode of your podcast and refrain from releasing any further unsolicited publicity ar around Hackett's Quarry. The providers of said land would not be against seeking legal actions if you do not comply with their requests. We just have to slide us a formal request with the benefit of both parties in mind, respect to yours, Travis Hackett, Sheriff, North Kilt Police Department, Upstate New York. That must be the podcast that, um, that Ryan was listening to. I guess they never canceled the episode. Radcliffe and Edward Benson. Wonder who they are. We're building Vegna? Like Stranger Things? Not so much birthday. a hint as a slap in the face. Oh. Fuck. 
I'm gonna need to rest soon. We're not resting, we need to find that password. There's a Vagna in D and D. Then again, all the monsters from from Stranger Things are D and D monsters. Now you mentioned that. So I guess that would make sense. Wait, is his name even Vagna then, or is that just like the nickname they gave him? boy 56 that means he was born in This can't be doing too well. <sighs> I need to lie down. You need to lie down. There's no lying down here. He was the god of undeath? What is undeath? And secrets. How many secrets are there? Am I tripping balls? Am I tripping massive balls right now? I just sort of saw a thing. July 7th? July 7th, 1965? Okay, no I'm not... Ignore what I just saw. No? what he used to knock me out. We're liches. I can hide this in my cell. July 6, 1965. Okay then. Okay, I didn't hear that. Oh, I didn't hear that. It's not real. A delicious a wizard found a path to mortality turned themselves into a smart zombie with magic? A magic zombie? That sounds terrifying.
Fuck yeah. hikers at all but ghost hunters who went in search of answers and fell victim to the mercy of the hag of Hackett's quarry never to be seen again like us except for the fell victim to the mercy of the blah 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 blah, blah part we're, we're more like um ghost investigators specter sleuths sure so what happened next well according to reports from the local paper the north kill gazette some hay bales caught fire during the opening night, and that spread pretty quickly. Before they knew it, the whole place was up in smoke, including the show's leading lady and her alleged baby. that I'm sorry I don't have much DMV knowledge I have exhausted this and myself I need to sleep Building? Yes, there is. His name is Max. First, we're gonna put our handy dandy syringe in the brick. No, she needs to go to sleep. Now we still sleep. Sleep. You want to tell me what happened? I could ask you the same thing. Why didn't you run? I won't leave Max. I won't leave Max. This doesn't mean I trust you. I don't care. I just want to help him. Turn around, hands against the wall. Seriously? I am too tired to argue. But... Ugh. Me too. Brew some coffee. I don't even What's know, this? bro. An education. Watch. The, so do they like regrow their skin? What the hell happens? I need the answers. Very funny man. Give me the answers. Nice job cleaning up. The eye. I mean. It's 
harder than they make out in the textbooks. Especially when nobody's helping you. You're the doctor. Uh, animal I guess doctor. Not and no, I'm not. And I probably never will be stuck in here forever. You know, just because you know doesn't mean you know. You know? No. Uh, what are you saying? What? I'm not. This isn't what it seems to be. You're gonna have happening? to be more specific. You and Max are in just as much trouble as I am. My family? We didn't mean to hurt anybody. We're just trying to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Not really. We're gonna end this thing once and for all. We? We? Who's we, bro? What the hell are you saying? Yeah. Makes sense. Speak clearly. So, how is your family involved? My family... ...is down at the bottom of a well. What? <laughs> yes, me too, Zora. Family is the most important thing in the world. But if your whole family, you know, like... Every last one of them decided to jump down the bottom of a well, and they're all just hanging on the end of a rope. How can one person be expected to pull them all back out? You can't. So you pull on that rope, and you're just going to fall right down to the bottom of the well with the rest of them. And what's the point of that? Is it some of the family? Right, so you... Or is it all the of the family? You're the one at the top of the well with a rope? And Maybe all of them except him? Yes. That's what I'm thinking. I thought that was obvious. Yeah, okay, yeah, I got it. It's not obvious, Officer Forget Hackett. It. You're not making sense, bro. Some kind of metaphor, bro. <laughs> He's the man at the top with the rope, okay? <laughs> That's all that matters. Let's see how smart you really are. What is this? Information. He wasn't there when well, Max what does changed. It mean? Remember that. Remember he left before that even happened. He had already left both of them alone. Read it. Maybe that's why he left. When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal shall outward burst. One by one leads lambs to slaughter. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. And should you yourself be cursed, armed with silver and the first, when moon is full before its wane, rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer shall you face your blight or fear the dread of full moon's light. Yeah. Keep reading. Take gun? No, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna take his gun right now. That's not gonna help us. And if it's a bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. Perchance you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes its toll. Starting to get the picture. So they're afraid of water? It's not a lot to go on. And frankly, it's shit. Why did they have to make it rhyme? <laughs> I don't know. But it's all we have to go on. Kill the werewolf that bit you and you'll be cured. It has to be silver. It has to be full moon. Silver Seems pretty werewolves. straightforward to me. I think that's if you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big if. 
Vote I just want to cure Max. It's not as straightforward as you think. Why didn't they just kill the original one then? Wouldn't that kill all of them? If you knew all this, why didn't you just kill it in the storm shelter when you had the chance? It's not so. I'm. I, I was when I straightforward. No, yeah, it's so not. You... They're not so easy to hit. I was trying to protect you too. So what's the plan? Well, that's where I'm hoping you'll come in. Me? What? Yeah. Because your studies. What? I haven't even started. He wants her to kill the werewolf? Well, you're the best option I got. Are you serious? I've been hunting this damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? Maybe it doesn't matter because maybe there's another way. Whatever you believe, there's got to be some science. And you do science. Apparently, he can't find it. <laughs> Look, take some time to think about all this. I'll be back in the morning. Seen enough? What do you show him? I don't think I'd believe a word he just said if I hadn't... If I hadn't seen that. You're not sure? No, you definitely believe him. Come on now. You got your eyes scratched out. I believe him. You can't tell me you really trust that guy now. I didn't say that. I said I believe him about... The werewolf stuff, not the science bit. I don't know what he wants. He's a dirty line kidnapping cop, Laura. We should be careful of anything that fucker says. You literally turn into a werewolf, my dude. You scratch my eye out. Well, fuck him. He's had his chance to fix this. We're getting out of here and we're gonna fix it on our own. Hey, Laura? Yeah? I saw what happened. What I did to your eye. Yeah. Is it bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm so sorry. Pissing me off. He's your boyfriend. You love it. It wasn't you. I know it wasn't you. I know. But it was. We're gonna fix you, Max. I promise. I promise. The sheriff keeps spraying him blows, that's the thing. Who? The clowns person. Did he show up? How'd you find out? Bobby told me. Said you scrapped an abandoned car. A while back, I, I worked out the rest. Shit. Why? Well, why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You're still here, that's fucked up. Oh my god, Chris is one of them. Chris is literally the werewolf. You shot me. Oh my god. I'm telling mom. Your lucky stars wasn't silver. What's your plan? Can't keep him here forever. I'm handling it. Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't have been at the camp that night. You ever think of that? 
I'd have done my job, you'd all be in prison. You were thinking that? That was all Bobby and Caleb. Are you those know hikers? It. That, that, that fucking journalist? Damn it, Travis. What are we gonna do now? Whatever happened to, we're all in this together. Shit, man. Let's go to my office. We shouldn't talk here. Max! Uh. Max! Uh. What is it? Travis was just in the hall talking, the cop. So? With Chris Hackett. Was he here to let us out? No. He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. That's why... Holy... That's why when the car wasn't working, Chris kind of had like this weird like mood where he like freaked out and like got like hella angry at one of uh, at Jacob. Now it makes sense because he was he was gonna turn that night. Shit, that's who would have guessed? I mean, I guess thinking about it, I could have. And yet you didn't. It all makes sense. That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter because it was his fucking brother. God, it's so obvious. If, if Chris was the one that bit me, then... Yeah, then that's our cure. That's their cure. That's yeah. how we fix you. Jesus, Laura, are we thinking the same thing? Tomorrow, we're getting out of here. I'm gonna get Travis's gun and kill Chris Hackett. Hey! Hey! Help her! Laura needs help! Uh, Laura? Oh God. Laura, are you okay? God damn it. <laughs> What the hell's going on? Laura! <laughs> Starting to think you were really sick. Well, maybe I should consider acting as my major. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> Aww. We should go before he wakes yeah. up. Should grab our stuff. We need silver ammo. He must have some around here. What is it? I thought I heard someone. After that, like, you know, oh well, everybody's coming else from behind that door. I think it's the ghost, the ghost of the woman. Yeah, Jacob was hearing it too. There's nobody in here. What the fuck? 
Fuck. He makes them. What is it? Shotgun shells. He loads them with silver. That's where he was last month, hunting. Well, I guess I won't be needing this anymore. You should still take the gun. Hey, I just realized something. We're free. Oh. <laughs> are we? Are you? Oh, yeah, we are. Hell yeah, we are. That's two months we'll never get back, but for now, we're one step closer to going months, home. Bro, I would have gone crazy in there. Tonight, going to Hackett's quarry, and we're killing Chris Hackett. I can't believe they didn't take the. my way here to camp left max at the island left max at the island seemed like the best place for him surrounded by water and all oh max is the one that chased them on the island that's who that was i was wondering i'm like why is this guy stuck here that's it that's the story and i'll jump in at the same time Wait, in the island? Like like our island? Like the one in the lake? Yeah, why? Because Jacob, he went back there looking for Emma and he hasn't come back yet. Neither of them has. Oh shit. I guess they needed money? Well, if they were there, they're not there now. What's that supposed to mean? Don't make me spell it out for you. I've just come back from there, and there's one werewolf and no people. Oh, fuck. All I know is I have to do this. I have to kill Chris Hackett before it's too late. Where did she get the eye patch from? Because she didn't have it. <laughs> after you saw me at the pool, after I shot Chris... I went back to the island expecting Max to be back to normal. But... I guess they need money, you know. Sometimes you just need some money. Didn't shoot Chris. She thought it was Chris, but it was it was the the, the person in the pool.
know about Max. I don't know if the other ones were created by him. So the werewolf I killed can't have been Chris. That wasn't a werewolf. It was Haley Hackett, Chris's daughter. Haley Hackett, Chris's daughter. Whatever I shot, that was no girl. Unless, I, I guess, it turned back after I shot it when I went to the island. Wait, so how come Max didn't kill you? Oh, Max bitter? Well, we don't want to have a zombie situation. He tried. I got away. Oh, no. I need to end this. We don't have much time. I hope Brenda's song is just chilling. What the hell is this? Oh my god, is that Lin Shay? Are we insidious? So this is our new gas. Smell good, don't I? Go on. Take a bow. Go on. Dumb fucking animal. Oh, Jacob! Ah. I'll call the cops. <laughs> please let me go! Okay, I didn't mean for this to happen, please! Please! Oh my god, why aren't you answering me? Oh, 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 is your, is your money that you want? Cause, cause my dad's got money. Like lots of it, how you, I mean not really, but you could get some, probably. Please, <laughs> just let me go, please! Oh, I'm Jacob so pleading? sorry! Why is he pleading? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> and he still has no clothes on. That's too, Bobby. <laughs> Is that the basement? Oh, it's over. Nosy little rat, aren't you? Poking your nose where it doesn't belong. Don't believe everything you hear. Anyway, here we are again. Let's see what you've brought me this time, shall we? The chariot. The reins of a chariot, we would all feel safer. It's taking control, relying on determination to make our choices. Valiant, but in some cases, foolish. Many seek refuge in chariots. But perhaps, in some cases, they're not as safe as we think they are. The world. Ah, the world. 
Often travelers' paths are direct, but sometimes it is not so simple. Sometimes they're intertwined with others. Compassion over anger. You will need friends where you're going. It's not until we fall into the belly of the beast that we realize how perilous things can be. And the same question as always. Will you let me show you more? Let's see the vision. Chariot or world? Only one future can be seen. I'm leaning for Choose. the world. It's world time. Let's see it, let's see it. Brian, Nora, Brian. Oh no! You'll be seeing me a few more times before the night's over. I look forward to that, as long as you follow the right path, of course. Woo! Alright guys, so I think that's gonna be it for tonight. I think we made a pretty good progress although it was only one chapter today I think it was a pretty long one so uh, this is chapter 8 the belly of the beast that we shall continue tomorrow if the universe is kind to me thank you uh, both of you guys for being here and Seafell I guess um, as always please remember to stay safe Please remember to stay hydrated, and I hope to see you all tomorrow for the next one. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.